Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. I am excited to show you guys what I thrifted this week. I'm hopefully going to be coming out with more content, not just things that I'm finding while thrifting, but for now, I've just been finding some goodies, so I'm excited to show you guys. But before we get into the video, I just wanted to say I am working on a studio tour video for you guys. If you don't know, we've been converting part of our detached garage into a studio space for me. I have been trying to run my small business out of our house and it just got to be too much. Um, we were running out of space. And so very, very grateful to now have my own space to be able to take photos of items, um, package up items, ship items out, film content, you know, film videos for you guys. And I've also been able to have friends over here. It's just amazing to have a detached workspace um, from our house. So I am working on that for you guys. And we're just waiting on some things to kind of wrap up. We have been waiting on the windows to come in since like July. So they're finally getting installed on Thursday. Fingers crossed that it actually happens. And yeah, just wanted to say thank you for coming and watching another video. I've been having fun with, you know, the weekly YouTube videos and showing you guys what I'm finding each week. So I hope you enjoy. First, I found this down-filled pillow. I always try to snag pillows from the thrift when I see them and I liked the design of this one. I also found this round cutting board that's in great shape. I plan on adding a leather string to it. And then you can never have too many vintage books. I found this pretty sage green colored book. And I also found this really cute Santa cookie jar. I'm not sure if it's vintage or not, but I need more Christmas decor. So I got it. And then I also got this brass bowl. I love the edging on this one. I also got this brass matchstick holder, but I feel like you could also put dried florals in it. And then I always buy these mini baskets for my daughter's play kitchen or for her toys. So then I found this unique vintage piece. Um, these were used to heat up irons back in the day, but I thought it would make a really unique doorstop. I'm not sure if I'll keep it or bring it to the shop. And then I found this large white tote that reminded me of something you'd see at like Target. And those are great for storage. So here's the clothes that I found, this linen top, which I ended up getting. This dress didn't work out. I really liked the pattern, but it didn't fit. And this was way too long. And then this dress I liked, but it was weird on the hips. And it was also missing a button at the bottom. This cute scarf. I ended up getting this Melissa and Doug horse holder. I need to get the horses for, but it was $3. And I also got this for my daughter. It's a stethoscope. And then my last find was this adorable baby quilt. I'm not sure if it's handmade, but it is so precious. And I can't decide if I'm gonna keep it or bring it to the shop, so definitely keep an eye out. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this week's video. I hope you also have a very Merry Christmas, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.